Right now at 5, a lacrosse ordinance makes it illegal to camp overnight in city parks. So what's next for the city's unsheltered population? You're watching WKBT Lacrosse. This is News 8 Now at 5. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us for News 8 Now at 5. I'm Ken Kozarowski. It has been less than 24 hours since Lacrosse Common Council voted to ban overnight camping in city parks, effectively ending a months long battle between the public at large and the city's unsheltered population. News 8 Now's Michael Germain joins us live from Cameron Park in Lacrosse tonight with reaction to the decision. Good evening, Michael. Ken, for many people in lacrosse, last night's decision brought a sigh of relief. For others, it signaled tougher times for folks already caught between a rock and a hard place. The ordinance changes the way police enforce camping on city property, primarily parks. While sleeping overnight on public property has always been illegal, officers could only enforce the law if signs were present announcing the rule. Since camping at Huska Park was banned earlier this year, many of the city's homeless have found their way to other parks and even public parking ramps. Enforcement of the new ordinance could begin as soon as today and where the city's homeless population goes after that is anybody's guess. But the folks we talked to today tell me there's no one size fits all answer to such a complex problem. You know, there's people that are homeless that are not causing any problems and then you got the homeless that are drug addicts and stuff like that and they need to weed them out not the ones that are homeless and trying to just survive. Homeless people we talk to say even homeless people that we talk to say even if they force to leave the city's parks the problem of homelessness isn't going away. Shelters in the area are at capacity. Coming up at 6, we'll hear from one unsheltered resident who says removing homeless people from parks may feel safer for you, but creates more danger for them. Ken? All right, Michael Germain reporting live at Cameron Park. Thank you, Michael. Habitat for Humanity will soon open applications for four new homes in the region. Three of the homes will be on La Crosse's north side, and the other will be in Eitzen, Minnesota, out in Houston County. The program allows families to buy a home with 0% interest mortgage. Habitat will select families based on factors like ability to afford home ownership and a need for safe housing. The application period begins July 21st and will close August 25th. You can attend an upcoming homeowner expo to learn more. The La Crosse Expo will be July 21st and 22nd at the Habitat Restore. The Minnesota Expo will be July 27th at the Spring Grove Library. Improvements to the US 14 intersection with Shelby Road in La Crosse will start Monday. Now on Wednesday of this week, the Wisconsin DOT announced that Governor Evers approved the over $450,000 project. The improvements will include traffic signals, realigning the left turn lanes, and constructing ADA accessible curb ramps. US 14 will remain open with occasional lane closures, and that project is expected to be done by early October. The Pettibone Fishing Piers are back in place after being out since the fall. High water levels in the spring delayed when the piers could be replaced. The new piers are made of metal, and they're guaranteed to last for a minimum of 20 to 30 years. Now, the old piers were made out of wood, which had rotted by this point. The Parks and Rec Project Specialist Jim Flotmeyer thinks the wood piers had been in place for at least 20 years. He says the new piers will be safer and more accessible than those old ones. Sure, it was a pretty hot day today across the Cooley region as high temperatures soared into the upper 80s to low 90s here today. And some of us even dealt with a couple of showers and thunderstorms. Let's take a look now at your zone forecast for tonight. Temperatures dropping into the low 60s. Slight chance of a shower or thunderstorm also possible here. And as we head further south, you can see low temperatures tonight in the low 60s. 61 tonight in Stoddard, 60, 60 in Westby and 62 down south in Gaze Mills and Soldiers Grove. As we head into our central zones, upper 50s up towards the eastern and northern northern sides with the low 60s further towards the west like Arcadia there at 60 tonight. As we head into the Chippewa Valley, we can say low tonight into the uh, mid to upper 50s, low 60s, 58 Chippewa Falls for you, 60 tonight in Eau Claire, some passing clouds to the north. 8 to 8 forecast showing that we're still dealing with a few showers possible in the forecast through at least 8 o'clock. Uh, other than that, partly cloudy skies really throughout the rest of tonight. And we will be looking at a light wind at around 5 to 10 miles an hour. A check on your full weather forecast coming up in a few minutes. Sounds like a plan. Thanks very much, Derek. The new district attorney for Vernon County never thought she'd go into criminal law when she was in school, 
but now she's excited to represent her home county. Now, Governor Evers has appointed Angela Palmer Fisher to the DA position earlier this week. She is the first woman appointed to the county DA job. Palmer Fisher has been a sole practitioner out of Westby, focusing on juvenile delinquency cases and those surrounding mental health. She wants to make sure the county residents know she'll be bringing respect and dignity to every case she tries. And we'll have an extended conversation with Angela Palmer Fisher coming up tonight at 6. Now, she officially takes the job at the beginning of August. She says Assistant DA Jasmine Betancourt has done a great job paving the way for women to be in leadership positions in that county court system. Abortion after six weeks of pregnancy is now illegal in Iowa. The governor, Kim Reynolds, signed the abortion ban today at a family leader summit in Des Moines. Now, the law bans any abortion after a heartbeat can be detected, usually at six weeks. Reynolds says she's never been prouder to sign a bill into law. We've continued to stand strong, fighting the good fight, believing that the law would prevail and justice would be served. Now, there are some exceptions for rape and incest and the life of the health of the woman. It also has an exception for abnormalities that are, quote, incompatible with life. Pro-abortion organizations have already filed a lawsuit challenging that law earlier this week. The Biden administration has announced $39 billion in student debt relief. The administration announced 804,000 borrowers will have their student debt wiped away in the coming weeks. It's due to administration fixes that more accurately count the qualified monthly payments. Student loan repayments resume in October after a years-long pause during the COVID pandemic. The Supreme Court last month struck down Biden's loan forgiveness program to provide millions of borrowers up to $20,000 in one-time federal student debt relief. Today marks one year since the 988 Lifeline service began taking calls, texts, and online chats. The 988 number replaced the old 10-digit National Suicide Lifeline. The Wisconsin DHS says there have been a steady increase in calls since this new line launched. The DHS sees the increase in volume of contacts as a good sign. The organization says it means more people are reaching out to get help. We know that given the volume, just what the data and the numbers are showing us, compared to the Prior to 98 being a, a service available to people, it seems like the impact has been pretty amazing and that people are reaching out and getting help that they otherwise would not have. Now, the line can be reached through calls, texts, or online chats. In the first year, Wisconsin had over 91,000 contacts for mental health and substance use support. The Boys and Girls Clubs of La Crosse hosted its 10th annual summer showdown at Logan High School Swanson Field. With activities for all school-age children, there were parachute games, water balloons, an obstacle course, dodgeball, tug of war, even some relay races. A lot of stuff. Organizers say it's a great opportunity to show kids that they are part of an organization and not just the one club that they attend. And it's a great event for our kids to build team um, camaraderie amongst the club that they attend every day throughout the summer um, and really build a positive team environment throughout and carry this on through the rest of the summer. I want to sign up. With over 500 kids on the field, a fun-filled day of team spirit and club spirit. Keel says the biggest thing about today is getting to represent the whole organization of the Boys and Girls Clubs of Greater La Crosse. And of course, they have a great time with the kids. Just ahead, the CDC is facing large funding cuts. Those cuts could impact what local services are provided across the country. We'll have the details right after this. Put the power of News 8 Now in the palm of your hand with the free News 8000 app. Local, regional, national news, and more. Or customize it to focus on regions important to you. Plus, you can submit your own tips. Brought to you by Marine Credit Union. Lane's Farm and Fleet's summer pet care sale is going on now. Featuring unbeatable deals on the pet food and supplies you need to keep animals happy and healthy all summer long. Like large bags of Victor dog food starting at $44.99. Select dog and cat collars, leashes, and harnesses 20% off. Plus, don't miss great deals for summer projects like $70 instant savings on this DeWalt drill driver kit or $50 off this Simpson pressure washer. Rewards members save an extra $10. Find value at Lane's Farm and Fleet.
So that no matter what mess you brought into this church today, no matter what addiction and, and what struggle, no matter how many times you've doubted God or questioned God, that because of Jesus Christ, God's not holding it over your head. Instead, there is this amazing grace, there is this unconditional love that you and I can say, God doesn't just put up with us. God, God loves us. Join Pastor Mike Novotny each Sunday. Watch Time of Grace on Channel 8, WKBT. Add new gutters to your home to avoid water damage or add gutter protection to your existing gutters to keep out leaves and other debris. We install standard K-style gutters or larger capacity steel fascia gutters available in 25 different colors. Guarantee your gutters will never fail with proven protection. Voted LaCrosse's best gutter company, The Board Store. Superior products, superior installation at prices lower than most others. Invest wisely. The Board Store Home Improvements, prompt free estimates. Put the power of News 8 Now in the palm of your hand with the free News 8000 app. Local, regional, national news, and more. Or customize it to focus on regions important to you. Plus, you can submit your own tips. Brought to you by Marine Credit Union. The CDC is facing big funding cuts, and some of the effects will be felt at the state and local levels. The agency is poised to lose about $1.3 billion in funds as a result of last month's federal debt ceiling negotiation. The money was initially allocated through the COVID-19 supplemental funding. The cuts will directly impact state and local health departments. So, for example, a grant funding disease intervention specialist across the country was one of the first things to get canceled. The last two years of the five-year grant were cut, more than $400 million. The World Health Organization's Cancer Agency has labeled the artificial, artificial sweetener aspartame as a possible cause of cancer. But a separate group of experts looking at the same evidence still considers the sugar substitute to be safe. CBS's Tina Krause has more on the new research from London. It's 200 times sweeter than sugar, and the world's most widely used artificial sweetener. Aspartame is found in about 6,000 products worldwide, from diet soda to flavored water to yogurt. The World Health Organization's Cancer Agency now says aspartame is a possible carcinogenic, citing limited evidence for a type of liver cancer. But according to its own hazard classification, confidence in the assessment was low, admitting more research is needed. And this shouldn't really be taken as a direct statement that indicates that there is a known cancer hazard from consuming aspartame. Another group of experts from the WHO's Food Additive Committee concluded there's no convincing evidence aspartame is dangerous if people don't consume more than 40 milligrams per just over two pounds of their body weight, meaning the average American would need to drink more than a dozen cans of diet soda a day to be at risk. Results uh, do not indicate that occasional consumption should pose uh, a risk to most consumers. Do you drink things or eat things with aspartame? Sure. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Former U.S. Surgeon General Richard Carmona says it's a safe alternative to sugar. And obesity accelerates just about every disease, whether it's cancer, type 2 diabetes, hypertension, and so on. And so there's a reason that we want to reduce sugar consumption. But experts also advise making healthier choices like drinking water is best for overall health. Tina Krause, CBS News, London. The American Cancer Society is calling for more research on aspartame and advising consumers to watch their intake. Coming up, Hollywood actors are going on strike. The Screen Actors Guild Union is joining the Writers Guild to demand better deals from movie studios. It's a pretty hot day today across the Cooley region. High temperatures were a little bit above average for this time of the year. Some of us even saw some showers and a thunderstorms roll through this afternoon, also into early this evening. I'll have a check on your full weather forecast coming up after the break, and we'll talk about some more upcoming rain chances that we could be dealing with on the horizon. All that and more in just a bit. We'll be right back. So I come to this country looking for opportunities, and I found out the pilgrims. The opportunities in here are like infinity. Give pilgrims an opportunity, it's going to be great, and it's a really, really good place to work. 
Culligan Water takes pride in being your local water experts. We live here, work here, and dedicate our lives to improving our area's water. We deliver the world's best water treatment and the industry's best service to you. Culligan Water, your local water experts. For a paint that's washable, scrubbable, and stain resistant, choose Forever Interior Paint and Primer in one. Create a new look for your room for $29.98 per gallon after 11% rebate. Platinum Plus Interior Paint is a no-prep, no-prime paint built to last. We offer a variety of colors to match any decor. A gallon of Dutch Boy Platinum Plus Interior Flat Paint is just $36.39 after 11% rebate. Save big money at Menards. Which hotel? <gasps> Somebody say which hotel? I'm great at this. Dance your faves in the spa-like bathroom. Or enjoy local craft beers with breathtaking views at the Cambria. Book direct at choicehotels.com. Jolivet Family Farms, known for farm fresh fruit and vegetables, but featuring so much more. Come see all that we have. Homemade bakery, large selection of locally produced honey, gourmet popcorn, craft beer, wine, and cheese, meat and seafood, arts and crafts, and so much more. There is no substitute for homegrown freshness. Open daily year round. Jolivet Family Farms, West Salem. Enjoy time with your family by financing your adventurous side with Union State Bank. Whether you are looking to finance your dream home, boat, snowmobile, UTV, vehicle, or camper, we can make your dreams become a reality. Contact one of our lenders in West Salem or Black River Falls for all your loan financing needs. Make life even more enjoyable by banking with Union State Bank. Union State Bank, where customers and community come first. Member FDIC Equal Housing Lender. My career path, I started as a quality technician and was promoted three times in three years and now I'm a quality lead. I encourage others to apply at Pilgrims for the pay, the hours, the benefits, and to be one big loving family. Well, it sure was a pretty hot afternoon across the area today as high temperatures soared up into the upper 80s to low 90s across the Cooley region. Some of us even dealt with some showers and a couple rumbles of thunder today as well. But let's take a look at your zone forecast tonight. Low temperatures will be dropping into the 60s, 61 here for you in West Salem. As we head to our southern communities, we're looking at a low tonight of 62 in Soldiers Grove, 62 in Lansing, and 62 as well in Linksville. But meanwhile, towards Westby, you're looking at 60 degrees tonight with 65, however, in La Crescent. Meanwhile, in the central Central zones we go. We're looking at lows into the 50s further east, but the 60s, however, can be said further back towards the west, like Arcadia tonight. You're looking at a low of 60 in the Chippewa Valley across our northern zones. Lows into the 50s, especially further east. Low 60s back towards the west, like areas like Eau Claire for tonight. A check overall on the forecast here for you for La Crosse, 65 degrees. Isolated thunderstorms early, otherwise partly cloudy skies. Winds out of the west southwest at around 5 to 10 miles an hour. And for tomorrow, 88 degrees with a few isolated thunderstorms, partly cloudy skies. Winds out of the west northwest at around 10 to 15 miles an hour. Let's take a look down at your zone forecast for the day tomorrow. We're talking about mid to upper 80s here tomorrow afternoon. And as we head south, you can see more of the same here too, with 84 in Lansing, a high of 82 in Westby, 85 in Soldiers Grove, and a high of 88 to the north in La Crescent. Meanwhile, in the, uh, in the uh, central zones, we're looking at those highs into the low to mid 80s, with a high of 84 in Blair and 84 as well in Trempolo, 83 to the north in Osseo. In the Chippewa Valley, low to mid 80s here. Eau Claire, you're looking at a high of about 84 degrees this afternoon. So sky tracker showing right now that we are looking at just some clouds, a slight chance of a shower still possible in some spots. Overnight tonight, we're looking at mainly clear skies, a few clouds here and there. Same can be said as we head into tomorrow morning. Here's this next front that I'm watching. That's going to move through as we head into tomorrow afternoon. Out ahead of the front and along that frontal boundary, we may be looking at some scattered showers and thunderstorms rolling in tomorrow afternoon and also into the early evening, as you can see there behind me. But it's really not until late tomorrow night into early Sunday where we start to see the clearing here as we lose that daytime heating effect. So therefore, those storms will no longer exist. But as we head into Sunday, mixed clouds and sunshine and again, another chance of a few showers and thunderstorms. I think the chances on Sunday are much less compared to what we've been seeing here lately because they'll be well to the north and then again, well to the south, and you can see La Crosse and Eau Claire kind of in between the better storm chances north and south of the cities. Let's take a look now at the eight day forecast, and you can see that we will be entering a much drier period. Sunday, can't rule out a stray shower or thunderstorm, otherwise partly cloudy, but much drier conditions for Monday and Tuesday. Mostly sunny, 
Highs in the low 80s there. So a little cooler behind that cold front as well. Wednesday and Thursday, we pick up the temperatures again into the upper 80s, some spots reaching the low 90s. Another chance of showers and thunderstorms for Wednesday and Thursday as well. Other than that, mixed clouds and sun, highs in the 80s, lows, 50s and 60s. Back to you. Thanks, Derek. Television and movie actors hit the picket line today after their union decided to join the Writers Guild and go on strike. The work stoppage is having an immediate impact on Hollywood. Rachel Kim reports from L.A. On strike! Newly striking members of SAG-AFTRA picketed Friday, joining screenwriters who have been on strike since early May. No contracts! No actors! No wages! No wages! Both unions are demanding the same thing, a better deal from the Hollywood movie studios. We're ready to bargain today, tomorrow, next weekend, whenever. The union's main sticking points include limiting how artificial intelligence can be used, along with pay and residuals from streaming services. 99.9% .9 of the people that I'm fighting for right now are working class people. They are the ones that are being squeezed out. But the studios say the walkout comes at the worst possible time for an industry facing many challenges. In a statement, the Alliance of Motion Picture and Television Producers said the strike will lead to financial hardship for thousands of people who depend on the industry. This is the first time since 1960 that both unions have gone on strike at the same time, shutting down the industry. So any scripted entertainment is basically off the table. Um, all that's really left is reality TV. The actor strike also means that promotions on completed projects have stopped. To save yourself. Paramount Plus's your special career. ops Lioness, starring Zoe Saldana and Nicole Kidman, had its London premiere earlier in the week, but Monday's Los Angeles red carpet has been canceled because of the strike. Rachel Kim, CBS News, Los Angeles. When we come back, lottery jackpots continue to climb. Mega Millions and Powerball both into the hundreds of millions. And Americans are rushing to get those tickets. Join LaCrosse's number one remodeler. Good pay and benefits. No weekends. $2,000 sign on bonus. Work with the best. The Board Store Home Improvements. Apply online or in person. Why wait until November when Black Friday deals are going on now at Ashley? Take advantage of low monthly payments with 0% interest through July 2028, in-store only. Plus, shop doorbusters starting at just $2.99. Shop and save today, only at Ashley. There's a reason big dental bills often come as a shock. Because sometimes you don't realize what's not covered until you get the bill. That's why affordable dental insurance from Physicians Mutual is important. It can give you benefits that go beyond what you get from more limited coverage plans. Because no one likes a big dental bill, especially if you're retired or on a fixed income. For a free information kit, call or go online now. This isn't some discount plan or preventive only coverage. This is real dental insurance that helps cover over 350 procedures like cleanings, fillings, crowns, bridges, root canals, even dentures at any dentist you want. Dental insurance from Physicians Mutual Insurance Company helps cover preventive care, basic work, and major procedures with no deductibles and no annual maximum. For your free information kit with all the details, call now or visit sendinfokit.com. Physicians Mutual, Physicians Mutual. Holiday Inn Express in Onalaska is your corporate headquarters for all business or personal travel in the Cooley region. Conveniently located within walking distance of six restaurants, retail locations, and three grocery stores, we are at the hub of your corporate visit. With hot breakfast served daily, meeting rooms for corporate presentations, and a state-of-the-art workout facility, we have everything you need for your next business trip. Shop best-selling mattresses at Black Friday prices now at Ashley. With 0% interest through July 2028, in-store only. And save $1,000 on select Sealy mattresses. For better sleep and savings, visit your local Ashley store and experience Black Friday in July. Only at Ashley. <laughs> 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 You expect more, so thank you for watching News 8 Now. The jackpot for Friday's Mega Millions drawing is up to $560 million, and Saturday's Powerball drawing even higher at $875 million. 
A lot of clams. Americans around the country are rushing to get these tickets and dreaming of quitting their job and starting a new life. But financial experts say if you are the lucky winner, it's best not to tell anyone right away. Instead, take time to get those affairs in order. Don't do that. Take a step back. Think about how you're really going to receive this money. Protect your ticket. Don't rush to claim your prize. And also hire a team of professionals uh, before you claim your prize or in place to help you with this money. She says it's best to take the lump sum to avoid risk of not collecting the entire payout over the next few decades. Don't have to tell me twice. We'll have a look at what's coming up at 6 when we come back. And of course, Derek will have one more look at your forecast. We're busy. <laughs> I get it. So Stanton Optical works with your schedule. Buy online, pick up in-store, same day, and get a free fitting. I mean, look at my to-do list. Skip the wait. Get your kids' glasses made the same day, only at Stanton Optical. Find comfort in your world in a stressless recliner. Take a time out, have a seat, and enjoy a special offer from Drury's in Fountain, Minnesota. Save in an instant on stressless furniture at Drury's in Fountain. Right now, get a $100 instant rebate for every $1,000 you spend on any qualifying stressless sofas and recliners designed with the world's most innovative comfort features. Don't wait. It's time for stressless. On sale now at Drury's in Fountain, Minnesota. Lane's Farm and Fleet's Summer Pet Care Sale is going on now, featuring unbeatable deals on the pet food and supplies you need to keep animals happy and healthy all summer long. Like $5 off Blaine's brand Sensitive Skin and Stomach or Healthy Weight and Joint Dog Food. Your choice of canine carryouts or pepperoni dog treats, just $10.99. Select dog and cat toys are 25% off. Plus, get a free $5 Farm and Fleet gift card with every $50 pet purchase. Find value at Blaine's Farm and are you tired of looking out your dirty windows? Cooley Region Window Cleaning is here to help. Locally owned with honest and fair pricing and satisfaction is always guaranteed. More than dirty windows? If it's on your house, we can clean it. Call 769-7048 today for your free quote and get $100 off your service. Cooley Region Window Cleaning, we're doggone good. Call 769-7048 today or visit CooleyRegionWindowCleaning.com. I'm Brody from Great River Harley-Davidson. We'll be having events all season long. Whether it's your first time on a bike or you've been riding for years, we want to see you here. Stop by and see us anytime at Great River Harley-Davidson. At Stanton Optical, you get great value on eye care, including contacts. Right now, get a one-year supply of AccuView Oasis and an eye exam for only $189. Scan now to book your eye exam. Yay, technology! Slight chance of a shower thunderstorm possible again for tomorrow. Sunday, partly cloudy skies. Slight chance of a shower storm can't be completely ruled out, though. We're looking at uh, some cooler temperatures to start early next week on Monday and Tuesday under mostly sunny skies. Wednesday and Thursday, another chance of showers and thunderstorms possible. Highs mainly in the 80s, lows in the 50s and 60s. Back to you. And just to add on what Derek was just saying, we do have a new thunderstorm warning. It's for Dunn County until 545 tonight. Possibility of one inch hail and 60 mile per hour winds. Thanks for joining us tonight at 5. We'll see you at 6.